Hey girlfriends, welcome back to the channel for another video this week. If you're new here, my name is Jernika Micea, but all my friends call me G. And if you are a returning subscriber, thanks for coming back this week and clicking on my face. Now, if you haven't already, go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up, like, share, comment, subscribe. Make sure to follow me on my Instagram for all of the fabulous updates and come back each week for weekly uploads. So right now, denim is heavy on trend. Now, I'm not really a trendy girl, but I wanted to make this video to kind of like push you guys in to invest in, in this trend because if we've been honest y'all this is the first trend in a very long time that i feel like i am investing in because when it comes to denim denim are pieces that never go out of style denim is timeless no matter what piece it is it can be a bag it can be shoes a belt denim is timeless you're going to have it in your collection for a long time so in this video i'm just going to share just a few looks on how i plan to um style some denim pieces hopefully you guys enjoy it if you do do not forget to give this video a big thumbs up and let's hop right into it all right y'all so the first look i literally wear this at least once a year and it's going to be a look that i'm going to create with this denim jumpsuit now since denim is on trend right now i would definitely re highly recommend you guys look for a denim boiler suit because let me tell you something this piece right here i've been having this since 2019 i picked it up from target for like 40 dollars i wear this thing all of the time but when it comes to spring like spring summer i love pairing it with the pieces that i'm about to show y'all right now I, like i said this look that i'm going to show you I literally wear this thing at least once a year well probably once a year and all I do is change my hair makeups and like accessories like sunglasses and stuff like that but for the most part once a year you're gonna see this piece okay you're gonna see this look I mean so first I'm gonna pair it with these Dior club Dior clogs now I don't I spend too much money on these shoes not to get enough wear out of them I think I don't get enough wear out of them because do you hear that when I'm coming, you're going to hear me coming, okay? I don't want you to hear me. I want you to see me, girl. But I'm going to pair with these Dior clogs because I feel like these clogs, it has like this denim vibe. And they just look so good with this jumpsuit. And I'm going to pair it with the Dior Vintage Saddle. Another piece that I do not get enough wear out of. But when I reach for her, girl, she always completes the look, okay? She do, she she shows up for me. So with this bag and this look, I want to put it on the shoulder just to give that um, effortless vibe because I feel like with denim, denim is so casual and you want to go for like an effortless chic vibe. And I feel like with the Dior saddle on the shoulder, like, are, are you seeing this right now? Like, can we just get into it? Like, it's a vibe, right? I think on the shoulder, it, look, it looks so much better than if I was holding it like in my hand and what i love about it is that the cd is kind of like giving you i'm accessorizing but i'm not trying too hard and to break up all of the blue i just paired it with the white hermes extra wide click i have on a white lace bra just to give it a little sex appeal because for me this does have like a full zipper if i zip this thing all the way up y'all i do not like the way that looks that's just not my vibe so just to show a little skin i'm gonna open it up i put on a lace bra usually every time i wear this i usually switch out the, the color of the bra i have so many lace bras so today i wanted to go for white just for a clean denim look so since this look is given like early 2000s meets 2023 because denim is on trend i thought i wanted to go with these yellow tinted frames just for like a more of a vintage retro look and also in the spring summertime i love a tinted lens girl so i'm going to pair with these gucci tinted yellow aviators but it's like a shield aviator i don't know if you guys are getting the vibes but yeah and for my hair today i just have it like crinkly with two braids something easy fun for summertime and yeah just like that i look super put together i look like i tried hard and i did not a denim boiler suit y'all it is so easy to dress up even with this look if i was going out to like a day lounge or something i could put on a pair of belly bear heels possibly keep the same bag because i just love this um dior vibe with the denim i just feel like it's so good you see the accessories like you see the materials okay but even if i wanted to switch out glasses with denim you can just do so much so right now y'all y'all know i'm not a trendy girl but denim is something that i feel like hop on it because right now you can get any and everything in um that's made out of denim and i promise you it's going to be timeless in your wardrobe by now and i promise you later it would definitely come in handy all right so i also picked up this dress from zara when i was in new york can we just get into it y'all i was so nervous because this was the last size and this is the large 
one thing i'm loving right now zara is literally adding stretch into all of their denim pieces and the curvy girls can fit it okay can we just get into this it's giving you body okay however i can still walk i can still move the only thing for me i'm going to get my um the lady who tailor uh, all to my clothes i'm going to get her to um tighten up this part so i won't have to keep moving it so i am going to get it altered now with this look i paired it with my page platforms just for a fun pop of extraness which i'm loving with the white toes i don't know if you can see it it is white toe and ankle season girl get in line get in formation i paired it with the white jody um white jody dupe from amazon that you girls are on my head about listen every time this bag comes back into stock i am going to link it i don't know how many this seller is restocking the last restock i don't care what nobody say she had to restock at least five bags because that bag sold out within minutes so every time this bag come in stock i am going to let you girls know everybody keep asking me about other sellers i cannot speak on other sellers because i don't know if the quality will be the same so that's why i don't link those bags but i paired it with this bag white air mask cup something about denim and white i think it is so beautiful so anytime i'm wearing denim most likely i'm going to try to go for white accessories i have these white strappy sandals that's in storage I'm in the process of changing my wardrobe over so if i had those i would probably be trying those on with this but right now this is the only shoe i have available that i feel like will go for this for the video's sake but if i had a pair of white strappy sandals most likely i would have those on for sunglasses because listen sunglasses complete a look period i don't think we have to even get into it so i have these and i just feel like this is so effortless and for the necklace i just have on my tennis necklace see this is why i want to get this altered so i won't have to keep moving it i want her to literally cinch this in so i won't have to move it because it keeps trying to flap over but i love this y'all the skin is skinning we've been doing skincare and this is something i'm actually going out of town and i'm going to take this with me now the only thing I'm going to switch is the shoes. Most likely for this look when I go out of town, I'm going to have on those white um, strappy sandals just to give it a little more of a summer vibe. These platforms right now, it's going good for the sake of the video, but I will love this deep denim with white. Because look how it looks with the bag. Don't that look good? So just imagine the shoes being white. I don't think I have any... I'm going to switch... To a pair of white shoes just so you can get the vibe they're not heels but you're gonna get the vibe just wait so i put on these air mask around sandals they're not white but they're pretty light just to give you kind of an idea because i don't have any other white shoes to kind of like give you the idea that's in my head i like i think the white shoes are going to go better than the platforms because i kind of like like this very deep blue denim with that white and just imagine my shoes being like a strappy white barely this sandal i think this would be it yeah so this is going to definitely be a look that i'm about to pack in the bag i don't even need to hang it up because it's coming with me i'm going to wear the same glasses and everything because i feel like it's clean it's effortless and she's on trend girl all right y'all so for this next look i have changed this look so many times because i feel like with this top you can do so many things with it originally i had it on with a pair of um blue jeans now i didn't love it because i feel like those jeans need to be um tailored in a way so it just didn't work out in my other jeans they're being tailored right now so i was like let's put on a pair of cargos and see the vibe so i have on this a blue denim tube top with some cargos from zara and my Saint Laurent page platform now i'm still playing on this look because i feel like this is a look that i personally could definitely see myself wearing i need to invest oh i think i have some i need to invest in some good everyday barely there sandals I feel like the time for a padlock will be a little too dressy, but I need something on that. Oh, a pair of Aqua Zeros will be really good with this because Aqua Zero is such an understated shoe, but I'm getting off track. So I decided to pair this little look. Now, this is so trendy because right now denim is on trend, but also cargos is on trend. If you're like me, I told myself I am not buying another pair of cargo pants. This was the last pair. I am done. Like how many pair of cargo pants do one person need? I'll wait. So literally as I'm recording this, I started to switch it around. So 
by the time I wear this, it may not even look like this. So I was thinking about pairing it with these Dior Aviators because right now I feel like, like I said, I'm revamping the sunglass collection, but these are so neutral and they can go with anything. And for bags, I don't really know, but since we have this here, let's just throw it on the shoulder and see. I feel like this is definitely giving early 2000s. I'm like a part of the girlfriend's cast vibe, but I don't know, I like it. I kind of wish my shoes were like the complete gold all page, page platforms. Oh my God, y'all. See, this is why I need to switch over my wardrobe. As I'm sitting here thinking, I'm like, I need to buy a Bailey Their Sandals. I'm like, I purchased a pair of Bailey Their Sandals in gold, black, and white last year. They're literally in storage. The gold Bailey Their Sandal will be so good with this because it's so sleek. Ugh. So just imagine, you see how you can see the gold? Let's act like these are gold belly bear sandals. I think that would be so good. I feel like I still need to do some tweaking to this look, but this is kind of like a rough draft. Yeah, this is a rough draft because also with this look, I would definitely want to do a top knot. The wheels in my mind, they're still turning because like I said, I just pull this together as I'm getting dressed. But how about we do this? I want to take off this shoe because by it having like this platform animal print, I feel like it just adds too much to that shoe and that wouldn't be what I would go for. Okay, yeah, it's definitely time to switch over the wardrobe, but this is more of a better representation of what the look will look like without the shoes. So just imagine a barely there sandal and yeah. The rough draft because even right now the wheels are still turning all right girlfriend so that is all that i have for the video but before we end this video out i did want to share this denim bag that i picked up from zara now i did when i was in new york i purchased the denim bottega jody but i end up returning that bag because don't get me wrong it is a beautiful bag but i feel like i did not love it for the price and when i got it i just didn't love it for the price you know so when i saw this bag literally as i was returning it i walked to zara end up seeing this bag in person and i was like my itch for a denim bag has been scratched this was 60 dollars i love about it is the quality if you can hear it it's like this very sturdy material it has i don't know if you can see it it has like this magnetic closure i love it it comes with a detachable um shoulder strap and i just think it's super cute like i think it is super super cute you can wear it so many different ways crossbody you can use it a top handle i also got it in black because i just felt like for 60 dollars this is something that i feel like i'll reach for and ever since i um purchased it which been, which has been like two weeks i've worn this thing at least three times already so i did want to share this before we end out the video because if we're being honest y'all as I was creating this video, I had looks prepared behind me, but for some reason, when I'm doing these videos lately, it's turned into like me playing dress up and then I'm start, I start to change everything. I'm like, okay, I don't like this. So yeah, a lot of things changed during this video, but I did create a look with this bag, hopefully in another um, styling video, you guys will see me style this, up, style this up, which I'm sure in like another style inspo for spring looks. You guys have seen me style this up but yeah girl hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did go ahead and give it a big thumbs up and i will see you girls in the next video